but uh, <laughs> you're not supposed to have anything once you see. <laughs> No, in fact, I'm going to tell a story of, uh, which is true, it happened to me. Uh, I was seeing Aida in, for, for the first time with uh, Ser Maestro Serafin in Torino, and the Celi Azzurri is very difficult, I must confess. There are other pieces that are more difficult, but I was young too, and so I ordered myself a cognac, because somebody told me that it would give me courage. <laughs> <laughs> So, Maestro Serafin saw it pass by his uh, dressing room. He says, who's that cognac for? So they told him, it's for Miss Callas. I was Miss then. <clears throat> I am Miss now, too. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, he says, take that back. And he comes very angry in my dressing room and told me, uh, this is how you get into the bad habit. First of all, of not using your muscles, reflexes. <clears throat> and for once, you start drinking one cognac, and the next time it won't be enough, you'll, drink, you'll be drinking two, and by that time, you'll hit the bottle. <laughs> and it's, it's very true of very many of my colleagues. Well, I know. <laughs> I said very many, not two. No, but it's true, by not, by drinking, you don't use the... Um, <laughs> I hope not. No. <laughs> Gee whiz. You know, when I practice at it, I have nothing. <laughs> so now let's get back down to, to earth and to work.